World cinema is not the sum total of all films made around the world. Its use is analogous to the use of the term world literature. Goethe used the concept of world literature, world literature in several of his essays in the early decades of the 19th century to describe the international circulation and reception of literary works in Europe, including works of non-Western origin. An interest in world cinema suggests an awareness of high-quality films made outside the Hollywood studio system which dominates international viewership. However, some people use the term to refer to the film and film industries of non-English speaking countries in English speaking countries. Equating the dominant form of cinema with the dominant language English can be inherently problematic. There are many countries such as Canada, England, South Africa and even Asian countries like India where films are made in English but they are part of world cinema due to their marginal status in terms of access or viewership. It can be argued that an understanding of world cinema centering around Hollywood cinema suggests a Eurocentric view. World cinema is often used interchangeably with the term foreign film. Foreign is also a relative term, suggesting a Western viewpoint. One person's national cinema can be another person's foreign film. In fact, American independent cinema may be considered part of world cinema, as it does not have adequate access. Technically, foreign film does not mean the same as foreign language film, but the inference is that a foreign film is not only foreign in terms of the country of production, but also in terms of the language used. As such, the use of the term foreign film for films produced in the United States, United Kingdom, Australia, Canada or other English-speaking countries would be uncommon within other English-speaking countries. Topic. Types World cinema has an unofficial implication of films with artistic value, as opposed to Hollywood commercialism. Foreign language films are often grouped with art house films and other independent films in DVD stores, cinema listings, etc. Unless dubbed into one's native language, foreign language films played in English-speaking regions usually have English subtitles. Few films of this kind receive more than a limited release and many are never played in major cinemas. As such the marketing, popularity and gross takings for these films are usually markedly less than for typical Hollywood blockbusters. The combination of subtitles and minimal exposure adds to the notion that world cinema has an inferred artistic prestige or intelligence, which may discourage less sophisticated viewers. Additionally, differences in cultural style and tone between foreign and domestic films affects attendance at cinemas and DVD sales. Foreign language films can be commercial, lowbrow, or B movies. Furthermore, foreign language films can cross cultural boundaries, particularly when the visual spectacle and style is sufficient to overcome people's misgivings. Films of this type became more common in the early 2000s, as Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon, Amelie, Brotherhood of the Wolf, Y2 Mama Tambien and Talk to Her enjoyed great successes in United States cinemas and home video sales. The first foreign and foreign language film to top the North American box office was Hero in August 2004. The rule for foreign language films is that if you've done five million dollars or better in United States cinemas, you've had a very nice success. If you do ten dollars million or better in United States cinemas, you're in blockbuster category. Warner Independent Pictures ex-president Mark Gill said, on the other hand, English dubbed foreign films rarely did well in United States box office, except anime films. The 1982 United States theatrical release of Wolfgang Peterson's Das Bort was the last major release to go out in both original and English dubbed versions, and the film's original version actually grossed much higher than the English dubbed version. Later on, English dubbed versions of international hits like Unindine Dan's La Ville, Godzilla 2000 Anatomy, Pinocchio and High Tension flopped at United States box office. 
When Miramax planned to release the English dubbed versions of Shaolin Soccer and Hero in the United States cinemas, their English dubbed versions scored badly in test screenings in the United States, so Miramax finally released the films in United States cinemas with their original language. Topic. On DVD Foreign language films that are particularly successful in international markets may be taken on by the large film distribution companies for DVD releases. At the other end of the scale, many foreign language films are never given a DVD release outside of their home markets. The majority of those DVDs that are given an international release come out on specialist labels. These labels include Arrow Films UK label specializing in foreign language and cult English language films Artificial Eye US and UK Axiom Films UK British Film Institute UK Contender Entertainment Group label distributing East Asian films they bought out Medusa Communications in 2005, and own the sub-labels Hong Kong Legends specializing in films from Hong Kong and Premier Asia specializing in films from the rest of East Asia, particularly Japan, South Korea and Thailand. CEG bought out the label. The Criterion Collection, U.S. Dragon Dynasty, U.S. label specializing in films from East Asia. Eastern Eye, Australia. Facets Multimedia US Film Movement US Fortissimo Films Netherlands International Imagination Pictures US Janus Films US Kino International US label distributing foreign language art house and silent films Manga Entertainment US and UK label specializing in anime Masters of Cinema UK Mongrel Media Canada Optimum Releasing UK distributor of foreign and English language films in the UK East Asian films released through their Optimum Asia sub label Palador Pictures India distributors of highly awarded foreign language films from across the world Palisades Tartan US and UK Palisades bought out the back catalog of Tartan films when they folded Soda Pictures, UK Studio Canal, France Tartan Films, US and UK label distributing a variety of foreign and English language films, though primarily East Asian films. The company consists of Tartan Video in the UK and Tartan Films USA, as well as the Tartan Asia Extreme and Tartan Terror Horror labels. The company folded in 2008 and were taken over by Palisades. Topic. Television channels Cinemoy, US, UK channel dedicated to French films UTV World Movies India Z Cinema India Star Gold USA, India, Israel, UK Reliance Movies Pradhan Australia, India NDTV Lumiere India World Movies Australia Cinema World Singapore Topic See also Euro Cinema Dutra Award Dhaka University Film Society List of Cinema of the World Academy Award for Best Foreign Language Film César Award for Best Foreign Film World Fastest Movie History of Film Transnational Cinema World Cinema Foundation Muslim Cinema World Music <laughs>